yeah, you know, pretty neat. Yeah, Jacquez is a kid that's that's um, you know that's from a great high school program, Starkville, uh, Mississippi. A guy that uh, got a national championship uh, ring on his finger. Uh, we were kidding with him. He's actually on the side of their equipment, uh, 18-wheeler bus. You know, so that's the type of uh, kid and leader that they think that he is. And we had some needs in the secondary. Uh, so you know, he's a guy that's from three hours away. So he understands the North Mississippi, West Tennessee. Uh, you know, the environment that he's coming in here, I think it's going to be a great fit for us. He can play the safety or the corner position. Uh, and he's a guy that we need to get going this spring and, and get him on the field. Carson's a guy that's been very loyal to us and stuck with us since the early commitment. We've seen him for the last couple of years uh, at our camp. You know, so we've seen him run. We've timed him. We know he's fast. Uh, his, his tape is, is fun to watch because he makes a lot of plays at the wide receiver position, but we're signing him as a defensive back. I think he's a guy that, uh, that, that is physical, that can cover. Uh, and for us in our schemes, that's, that's, you know, that's what you all want. You want guys that can make tackles, but also co you know, cover some guys when you're in some, uh, some, some man coverage situations from the safety position. So uh, very proud to have Carson in, in this program. And uh, like I said, he's a guy that, that was loyal to us, committed early, and never wavered. And that's going to pay off for us because uh, he wants to be here, and we want guys that want to be in our program. Another Memphis kid, uh, very athletic. We've seen him in camps. We've worked him out at, at these camps uh, from a great uh, high school program. We've had some good players from Whitehaven over the years here. He's won a lot of high school games. Uh, brings us good size and athleticism and speed in the defensive back position. That's a position where we need to stockpile some players and, and refill some of those seats in that room. And, and Vincent's the guy that's going to be able to come in here and compete for us early. Kareem's a guy, once again, of, of, of a guy that uh, came and visited us early. Um, we offered him early. We were able to stick with him. We've known him now for the past six, eight months. Um, you know, able to watch him in spring practice, able to follow him through his senior year, came to a game, committed to us. Uh, we felt very fortunate with that uh, from the standpoint of, um, you know, he's not from the state of Tennessee, but from day one, he, he fit here. He fit with our coaching staff. He fit with what our values were, and, and I see him growing into a great leadership role in that linebacker room. Krishan Jackson is a, a junior college uh, player from North Mississippi. Um, I think his best football is ahead of him. He only played one year of high school football. He only played two years of junior college ball. He's a six foot, very long, fast corner, still learning how to play the, uh, the, the game. Uh, you know, I can't wait to get him in spring football, get him coached up. Uh, brings us immediate uh, depth and, and going to be able to compete for you know, playing time as soon as he gets here on campus. Uh, Rush is a guy, uh, coach's son, Coach Lancel there, Columbia Academy. Uh, you know, he understands it. He gets it. He understands the, the process of developing as a player. Uh, he's 195 pounds, uh, you know, safety, uh, that his body may even grow even bigger. And so he'll start in the safety position. Uh, maybe he grows into a linebacker, but he's a runner and he's a hitter and he's a very cerebral player. He's going to make our program better in a lot of aspects of, of, of different um, values and different work that, that he'll bring to our program, and, and then the size of being, you know, six foot six one is is another thing we're excited about with Rush. Jack's another guy we worked out in camp. He's, he's been committed to us. Uh, this is the first year we've been really aggressive with these early offers, and he was a guy we identified back in the spring and made the offer to him after we saw him in camp. Uh, he committed to us back in September, and he's been with us. Um, you know, the whole time and never wavered and anybody came in there to visit with him, he told him, you know, that I'm going to UT Martin. And so he's a guy that will get in this program and he's a runner and a hitter. Uh, but the leadership skills, the quality high school that he played at, you know, playing in the state championship game is, the, you know, th that's going to help our program. Hunter May, once again, high school kid. We watched, uh, saw practice in the spring, we were able to see him at some camps. Came over this summer, you know, drove up from Florida. So he was sat down with his, his mom and dad. He's 235 pounds now as a defensive lineman, but he uses his hands well. He'll continue to get bigger. He'll eventually be a 260 pound, you know, defensive lineman with, with length, with great intelligence and work ethic, and he's going to fit great in our program. Traquan's uh, highlight tape is very impressive, okay? Uh, you know, he's a, he's a five eleven and a half, six foot, very explosive guy, uh, a very good football player. Um, you know, mom and dad, first time on his visit here, uh, uh, you know, seeing West Tennessee, but uh, they fit in, in our environment. They fit in our family environment. They understand what this community could do for, uh, do for Traquan, Traquan and his growth as a player, and I'm very excited about uh, his growth as a defensive lineman. Tyler played on an outstanding high school team for Coach Diffie there at North Panola and, and uh, went deep into the playoffs. 
Uh, Tyler is very skilled at the DB spot and the receiver spot, and uh, very. I think his junior year he had seven or eight uh, wide, uh, seven or eight interceptions. Uh, very versatile, skilled player. He's a six foot, kind of slight in his weight, only 150 something pounds. But as he gets, you know, as he continues to put some weight and get stronger, uh, you know, he gives us a flexibility of playmakers in the secondary or the receiver position. CJ is uh, is is Kareem Hobbs' teammate, and, and they, we recruited them together. Uh, we think that they have a chance to, to. We're losing some good linebackers, and this is the the, the next opportunity to replace that linebacker room with freshmen that we think are the type of kids and the players that we need uh, you know to go forward at that position but very uh, very physical uh, can run and hit and uh, gonna be a good OVC player for us